Okay. Okay. Hello, everyone. Hi. Hi. Why are you making a mask? I'm the Great King Sejong. I just returned from the coast where I battled pirates and freed the prisoners. Hooray for King Sejong! That King Sejong sure is quite a guy. He sure is. Did he just say he battled pirates? That's right. He and his team battled the pirates and freed all the prisoners. And they made sure that the pirates would not bother the people again. Say, that's great. Yep. Hey, have you seen that book that he wrote? No, I haven't. What is it about? Well, they say it's about how to be a great farmer. And it has instructions on all these great things about farming. At least, that's what I heard, but I can't read it. Why not? Because it's written in Chinese. Do you speak Chinese? No, I'm just a simple farmer. I can't read Chinese. Can you? No, and I don't know anybody else that can read Chinese either. Only the scholars can read and write Chinese. I wish I could read and write Chinese. Then I could read books too, and if I wanted to write something down, I could. Me too. But I'm just a busy farmer with no time to learn Chinese. And there are no schools that can teach people, working people stuff like that either. Yeah. Say, you ever wonder why everything is written in Chinese? No. What do you mean? Well, are you Chinese? No. I'm Korean. Do you speak Chinese? No. I speak Korean. Then why is everything in Chinese? That's a good question. Hmm. I wish there was a way for us to read and write. Hello, King Sejong. <sighs> Hello, scholar. King, you seem unhappy. What's the problem? Well, scholar, I was just thinking about all of the Korean people in my kingdom who have no way of reading and writing. But the scholars and the aristocrats can read and write. But I mean everybody else. The common people who work hard but who can't read and write Chinese, they should be able to read and write too. Ah, so we should just teach them Chinese. Well, our language and Chinese are so different. What if there were a way that we could write ideas down in our own language instead of Chinese? But how could we do that? You can't just invent an alphabet. Oh yeah, that's it. We'll invent an alphabet. What? <laughs> what is the first thing you need to make an alphabet? Uh, letters? Right, letters. <laughs> but what are letters for? Um, to represent sounds? Right again. We need letters that will represent the sounds of what our common language. First, we need to figure out what those sounds are. Uh, what sounds do we make? We make many great sounds like ka ka ka, goo goo goo, na na na, nu nu nu. Uh, yes, I see, I, I think. Say this with me, please. Ka ka ka. Ka ka ka. ka. Goo goo goo. Goo goo goo. Goo goo goo. goo, goo, goo. Do you feel where your tongue is when you make those sounds? Oh, yes. Goo, 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 goo. The back of my tongue is touching the top of my mouth. Goo, goo, goo. It's making a shape like this. Oh. oh. <laughs> Wonderful. That will be our first letter. Now say, na, na, na. Na, na, na. na, na. No, no, no. 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 Feel where your tongue is. Ah, yes. No, 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 no. The tip of my tongue is touching the top of the front of my mouth. Mmm. It's making a shape like this. Mmm. That's fantastic. That will be our second letter. Now say, sa, sa, sa. Sa, sa, sa. sa. So, so, so. So, so, so. Su, su, su. Su, su, su. Feel where your tongue is. When I make a. It's blowing air past my teeth. Ta da! It looks like a tooth. Wonderful! Now say a kind of cute sound. Please follow me. Ah, ah, ang. Ah, ah, ang. Feel where your tongue is. 
Mm. Oh, the tongue is closing up that round part in the back of my throat. Like this. Mm. <laughs> Another letter came out. Yeah, this is the last letter. Now say, ma, ma, ma. Ma, ma, ma. ma. ma, ma. Mo, mo, mo. Mo, mo, mo. Mo, mo, 